When you talk about mannerisms of Romanians, I think a lot of times of these old Romanian guys standing outside of their houses and their shirt would be up over their belly and they'd be talking to you. It was one of my favorite things to go and talk to those guys that had their shirt over their belly. There were also some traditions or some ideas of things like curent and it was similar to like wind coming through your house and causing you to be sick. We have semi-similar things here in America, but not exactly like curent. Some of the other things is at Easter, you would say Christos anviat, adeverat anviat, which that just means Christ is risen, and you would say, yes, he is risen. And that was a way to greet people, and I loved that, because their culture was so Christ-centered. Even if a lot of people nowadays don't believe in Christ, a lot of people do, but their culture was so Christ-centered, and I loved saying that to people. It was one of the greatest things on every Easter to get to talk to people like that. Christmas time, they did one of my favorite meals. My wife and I still make this meal today. It's called sarmale. Sarmale is basically cabbage rolls. You throw some meat in it, usually um, por pork and rice. Uh, we throw onions in ours. We like onion onions in ours now, but you roll that up and you make these little cabbage rolls. They also did arde and plutz, which is stuffed peppers. I love stuffed peppers. We have them here in America, but they were so much better in Romania. I don't even know why, but they were just so much better in Romania. So those were some things that came around the holidays. In Oradia, my, my city that I was there for about a year, they had a clock tower in the middle of their city, kind of next to their town hall. And every hour on the hour, it would go off. And during Christmas time, it would sing a Christmas song on it. So I loved hearing that Christmas song and seeing that culture come out in Oradia.